Hello, this is Brad Tallis with NextGen Solutions, and welcome to this week's Fusion Friday. Today's topic is viewing dimensions in the design workspace. So let's take a look. So typically when you want to change your design, you go into the timeline and edit the defining sketch. So for example, I'll click on this sketch here. We can see all of the dimensions that kind of define the basic shape. And then I can double click on any of these and make a change. And we can see that the sketch stretched out a little bit. I'll say finish sketch, and we can see that the 3D model changed. Now, here's the tip I wanted to share. I like to use the show dimensions in the 3D workspace. To do this, I'm gonna expand open my sketches and I'm gonna turn on that first sketch. And we can see the outline uh, of the profile that created this 3D model. Well, if I right click on the sketch, there's an option here called show dimension. And when I do that, it actually turns on the dimensions from the sketch. And I can make changes right here in the 3D workspace. So we'll change the 100 to a 75 millimeters and instantly the 3D model updates. And I like this method better because when you're in the sketch, you don't really get to see the 3D object and you don't see what's happening. So for example, if I change this from 80 to 70, I don't really see what's happening until I finish my sketch and then I can um, get the feedback. So I like using the dimensions in the 3D workspace. So let's set that back to 80. Let's change this, you know, to 45, for example, and we can quickly see the changes that are being made. Now, I also have another sketch here, sketch two, that kind of defines how um, these grooves were created. So I'll do the same thing. I'll right click, show dimension, and now I could change, for example, the uh, height of these grooves from 10 millimeters down to five millimeters, and we instantly see the change. I'll go ahead and turn off my sketches, and I now have my 3D model. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, all I ask is that you give the video a thumbs up and share or repost the video with others in your network. This will help spread the knowledge of Fusion out to the community. If you have any comments or ideas for future topics, please reach out to me at bradtallis at nextgensolutions.com and I look forward to seeing you on the next Fusion Friday.